Hey YouTube, Zuck here, and welcome back to Project Zomboid. And today, like I said last episode, we got scratched again. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. Uh, give me two seconds, ladies and gentlemen. We'll wait for them. Move. Okay, uh, disinfect. And then bandage. Okay. Get rid of the day bandage. And we are going to head off to the chemist, which I believe is actually behind the shop. I think. Wait. Near the Giga Mall, okay, that's the Giga Mall. Um, it could be, yeah, okay, here we go. One chemist. Lollipop, because I'm going to be a good boy in the chemist. Mmm. Okay, now we just need to get in. Okay, that's a lot, obviously. Okay, you, ma'am. Just wanna. Just I'm gonna have to clear out some zombies. Okay, there's them out. Dog is barking. Gonna kill this zombie. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, any more zombies? Oh, yep, another one here. Okay, I'm hoping this ain't gonna sell for an alarm. Okay, gonna head in there. Okay, uh, let's just see what we got here. Disinfectants, that's good. Bathroom, so let's drink some water. Ah, and fill some water bowl. Okay. And one door should lead. Yep, back room. This is what I want. Because back room should have. Ah, here we go. So. Kind of tempted. I'm going to grab a such needle. That uh, uh, I'm going to finish off my bowl with disinfectant actually. And I'm wondering now with scratches. Now what is it? Right forearm. That was the one that was bleeding. I wonder. Can I? No, I can only disinfect. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that's good. So now I can have a nice little first aid kit. Oh, this is good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this first aid kit. And I'm going to quick there's my secondary. Only time I'm ever going to do this right quick and saying a secondary because I'm going to fill this up. I'm going to fill it up with my bottle of disinfectant. Two bottles of disinfectant, sorry. And then, what else can I need in here? I would need some band aids. Oh, painkillers could be useful. I'm going to take some of them. Suture needles. Could use them, yep. Beta blockers, I'm gonna grab one of them anyway. Oh, I'm gonna grab one. 
of them for myself. Uh, any depressants? Uh, oh, more pain uh, painkillers. Ah, tweezers. That's something I do need. And more band aids. You know what, let's just go out here a minute, if I can find him, I wouldn't mind getting some more cotton balls. Cotton balls. I'll right, take another suture needle. I want cotton balls. Do you only find them in first aid kits? I guess so. Oh well. That's good. I now have a nice little first aid kit to stick in my backpack. And I also I'll take some painkillers to get rid of this pain. And I can check this out. And I'm the reason I'm not gonna clear this place out is because I want to be able to leave some stuff. <sighs> Empty pot bottle, always good. Okay, let's see now what else we got tissue. I've got more stuff here. Uh -huh. Okay, that's good. Let's um let's take some beta blockers as well actually. Try and reduce some of my panic for being inside. And so my health is okay. Oh, first aid. I've leveled up first aid. That's good. Huh. Doing not bad in terms of my skills. I need to start getting my farming skill up, I think. So what I'll probably do is do an episode of farming. So let's... Uh, let's re-equip the shotgun. What do I repair the shotgun with? <laughs> I repair a shotgun with a shotgun. Hmm. Makes sense, I suppose. As I'm in the area, I might as well shoot this zombie because he's coming near me. Oh, sorry, she's coming near me. And you're also coming near me, sir. And we should check out Spliffos. See what they have here. Okay. I like this, near the electric seems to be out. We're not, not getting any fire alarms. Fire alarms? Burglar alarms. <laughs> Sorry. All potato seeds. Anyway, I thought I'd give you guys a little update. Uh, it's, it's so far in the episode, I haven't actually said it. Uh, I went and picked up my rental car um, Wednesday night and Irony of irony, they actually gave me, as my rental car, the original car that I really wanted when I was getting the options to upgrade. They gave me the original car that I really wanted. So that was actually quite nice to actually see. I got to see the car I wanted. And I've been driving it and it's a whole different ball game at the moment. P driving a car driving that car at the moment mainly because obviously it's the oh it ain't my car please for the love of god don't let me wreck this thing oh. dogs off again the family's going out to get dinner I've eaten so ooh whiskey uh, I don't think I've got any whiskey in my base you know what actually I know I'll be nice let's see if, if I got the stuff to make a nice hot cuppa. That would be quite nice. Uh, sugar. Canned beans and crisps I'm obviously going to pick up because well. It's food. A uh, spoon. Let's check the uh, coffee, yep. I need a cup and a kettle. Cup and a kettle. Cup and a kettle. Crisps. Uh, pop. 
Chardonnay. Fried chicken. Oh my god, on fried chicken still fresh. Is that uncooked? I'm not even going to take the chance of that because I'm not sure what's going on with that. Uh, I've got coffee. I'm. Oh, yeast. In that case, I better grab this rolling pin as well and this peanut bar. Need a kettle. Hmm. So like, is there a kill anywhere? Oh hang on my empty mug. Okay, so I just need the kill in there. Uh let's see now. I'll grab all this. And the bloody pop again. Let's check my health, yep. Health is still good at the moment. Toilets are over there. Okay, let's check these out quickly. Yep, they're definitely toilets. Okay, let's head back to my part of town. Maybe I've actually left something there, maybe some... a kettle maybe I've left there. Or in the Gigamore actually, I haven't... I need to check more of the Gigamore at some point. Ah uh, look, home sweet home. Well it will be when I've actually turned it into a home. Let's uh, drop some food off. Just canned beans. Chardonnay, chocolate, peanut butter, pop, all the, oh, uh, we drop this whiskey down here, we drop this rolling pin, and flour, and yeast over here, got the garbage bags here, okay. That's good. Now let's go see about finding a kettle. Aha! Of course, the coffee shop. Let's zoom in so I can actually see where I'm going. An empty mug, yep. That's a toilet. Ah, here we go. Here's the kitchen. Okay, kettle. Aha! Okay, now we just need the sink, which is... Here. Fill a water bowl. Fill an empty mug. Oops. Fill the kettle. And then, if I've done this right, it should be. Oh, what have I done wrong? Is it I. Hey, wait, am I meant to have an empty mug? Is that it? Yep, a very hot drink. Ah, good. Good, good, good. Nice hot cuppa. Just what the doctor's ordered. Okay, that was good. In case you guys are wondering why I'm not actually doing any building or anything at the moment, is I'm just basically giving myself a whole day to see whether or not anything c comes of the uh, wound, the uh, scratch I picked up. Obviously, I know a scratch has got a less percentage than a bite to cause a full infection. At the moment, I'm still classed as okay. Oh, look at that! 888 eight, eight zombies, that's not bad. <laughs> again, 
Again, eh? We're getting close to my be uh, my number of zombies to kill. Let's go check the gigamo actually. Let's see what other food sources we can get from there. I mean, look, I cleared out this whole shelf here, but look at this. Loads of stuff left to take. Ah. Oh yes, definitely worth coming in here. You know what I really need to do? Maybe next ep next couple of episodes, what I think I'm going to focus on is cooking. Well, cooking and farming. Right. Obviously, I probably can't do much in terms of cooking until I get some farming on the go. But the reason being is I want to get to the point where I can start using all this rotten food to uh, aid in my cook into my cooking to make my food a little more tasty and yummy. Okay, let's check out these ones. See, like all this stuff is so wasteful. It's dreadful, it is. Wasting all that food like it's all um I gotta leave that. Okay I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go to sleep for a few hours. Check to see whether or not the wound is weakening. Seems my trip to the chemist I've got some lovely painkillers, they seem to be kicking in. Kicked in. And what I'll do is I'm going to drop so it's over here and where that bloody hell and in there probably go and sleep oh I'm not tired enough to sleep well, that does make a change. Alright, sleep. Okay, I'm not tired enough to sleep. So I can't sleep yet, anyway. I'm still okay. So, I think I'm going to call it for there, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be the end of this episode. Uh, next episode, we're going to we're going to start building up some farms and get some more of the walls done. Thank you everyone for watching and I shall see you all next time. Bye bye.